Hello, Tommy, Tommy. We got a situation over at Printworks. You better go and check it out. I don't know, some kind of mess or other. Things are messed up. I gotta go. It's very helpful. Maybe a neighbor is tossing his leaf clippings on your lawn, or looking at your woman, or harboring desires regarding your longboat. You enslave his children, set his house on fire, you shall not bother you again. Hmm. It must be nice to have you as a neighbor, not. I live in no place longer than needed to fulfill my goals. Taking slaves, valuables, and food. Goal setting is very important, Amy, not just in football. You're very weird and creeping me out a bit, but whatever. No weirder than anything else. So, what do you think of Vice City? Ah, I like it very much. Your women here are prepared for battle. They are large, not like those scrawny things to the north. A woman who weeds well provides for... I don't think I've ever heard of that one. Great Carl Erson. Ye mainlanders have no historical perspective. Read the runes. It's all right there. Talk to a grandparent. But no, he cast people. Oh. Okay, what's the emergency? Oh. Who? Oh. Tommy. Some mob thugs said they'd come to take their cut. Said it was a Mr. Forello's money. Oh, I feel like crap. Forelli? Sonny Forelli? Yeah, that's the guy. I think they were very Holy insistent. Up. I'm not angry with you. Get him to the hospital. Tommy, rip that guy a new asshole for me. I'm gonna rip him too! Socialized medicine? Nah, you did it all wrong. You should have continued to the north and finished things off. I talk about this in the motivational learning tapes. That and beware the magpie. It is the devil. Evil reigneth when darkness falls. Are you married? You seem like a tough character to live with. Hi, your wife Helga. What a hag. This show is not sexist, whatever certain bearded women might say. Women are people too. I'd appreciate if you wouldn't talk that way. Ah, go live in a chimney each row. 20th century women are all the same. This traffic sucks. Or, but live in boxes. Then she says, Or, I'm getting the stomach stapled. I look fat. Now for the two yak skins. Where previously it was only one. I say, wench, don't come crying to me when we're in a longboat crossing the straits for two moons. You're all skin and bones. A man needs something to grab onto. I ain't her fault. The pressure thinks he got him back.
What's going on? Tommy! Oh, good, good, good. Listen, listen, uh, listen. I like fish. I love fish. I love them as pets in bowls, or as food on a plate, but as much as I love them, I don't want to sleep with them, okay? But right now, your Italian brothers are coming from up there to fit me with some cement shoes, and I- Shut up, Ken! Sit down. Lance, what the hell's going on? It's your friends up north, Tommy. They ain't too happy you kept their man. They're coming down to see the business today. They took longer than I thought. Guys, we gotta make this final. We gotta leave no doubt that this is my operation. Mine! Ken, you get the first one to counterfeit cash and put 20 mil in briefcases. Lance, you get the guys together. Tommy! What? No big hugs for your old buddy? I've had 15 years out of the loop. I'm a bit rusty <laughs> on family etiquette. Oh, he's angry, huh, Tommy? Didn't I say your temper would get you into trouble, huh? There's three mil in the cases. How many was it? Ten? No, eleven men. That's how you get to be called the Howard Butcher. <laughs> you sent me to kill one man. One man! They hey, knew Tommy, I was coming, son. Tommy! Watch your tone. Anyone would think you blame me for that unfortunate set of circumstances. Just take the money. Get the damn cash. You know, Tommy, I did what I could for you. I pulled strings, called in favors. I was your friend, Tommy. I hoped you'd see sense, see what's good for business. I trusted you, Tommy, and you disappointed me. But at least someone in your chicken shit organization knows how to do business. Isn't that right, Lance? I'm sorry, Tommy. This is Vice City. This is business. <laughs> you sold us out. No. I sold you out, Tommy. I sold you out. The real cash is upstairs in the safe. So, Tommy, what was the big plan? You think I'd just take the fake cash, save face, and run away with my tail between my legs? No. I just wanted to piss you off before I kill you.
one to cover your ass now, eh, Tommy? You're going down, you backstabbing prick. Oh, you think so? Double-crossing piece of shit! Your history, Tommy! History! This is the last dance for Lance Ben. What's going on? Tommy! Oh, good, good, good. Listen, listen. Tommy! Why? to cover your ass now, eh, Tommy? You're going down, you backstabbing prick. Oh, you think so? What's going on? Tommy! Oh, good, good, good. Listen, listen. Tommy! One to cover your ass now, eh, Tommy? You're going down, you backstabbing prick. Oh, you think so? Come here, you 
double-crossing piece of shit! Your history, Tommy! History! Wrong side, Lance. You took 15 years from me, Sonny, and now I'm gonna make you pay! You still don't get it, do you? I own you, Tommy! Those 15 years were mine to spend. Get him, boys! <laughs> Tommy? Oh my god, Tommy, wh what happened? What does it look like? It looks like you ruined your suit, and Tommy, that was a beautiful suit. Tommy, what on earth happened? Had a disagreement with a business associate. You know how it is. Tommy, I have a disagreement. I send them an angry letter. Maybe I pee in their mailbox. I don't start World War III. You know, maybe you should speak to my shrink. That stupid prick, Lance. Tommy, I never liked that guy, okay? He's neurotic, he's insecure, he's self-centered. The guy's an asshole. I'm glad you took him out. I don't think we're gonna be getting any more heat from up north either. Cause there ain't no up north anymore. It's all down south now. Wait, does that mean what I think it means? Tommy, baby! What do you think it means? That we're in charge. I mean, that you're in charge. Oh, Tommy! You know, Ken, I think this could be the beginning of a beautiful business relationship. After all, you're a conniving, backstabbing, two-bit thief, and I'm a convicted psychotic killer and drug dealer. <laughs> I know. Ain't it just beautiful?